guys, Denise Alcedo here for Red Carpet Report, and today we're at the Skirball Cultural Center for the 2016 Genie Awards. You ladies look so lovely tonight. Congratulations to both of you. Not only you guys, you're presenting an award for your daughter, you guys are sharing this moment together. How do you guys feel? I'm thrilled. I mean, you know, there will be a lot of filmmakers in the audience and TV directors and producers and writers. If you really want to know what an excited mother looks like and feels like, I'm the model. I am thrilled. It's, it's one of those great moments because Nicole has worked so hard and her subject matter has been difficult. And she has taken issues that are really not in the public eye, like homelessness for women and the trauma that they went through, rape in the military, rape in, uh, on college campuses, very tough issues, and brought them to light. And I'm so proud of her. It's a perfect Mother's Day gift, right? For me, it is. So, Nicole, how do you feel having your mom present you this award? Oh, it's awesome. I mean, I think my mom is, she's winding down her 30 years in, in political career. 40, sorry, and uh, so um, I'm excited for her next chapter, and I think this is a great way to kind of, in a way, for us to share this moment where we're both kind of transforming our lives and stepping into new career opportunities and new exciting adventures. So, so you mentioned that your documentary, it hits very important issues. What was the best advice that you received from your mom having her political background? Well, I think she, you know, she wouldn't try to give me political advice. I think she would just say that she would tell me when I showed her something how, how, that it moved her and that she felt like as long as we were being truthful and honest you could really feel that it was coming across and that that would move people and I think actually to bring it down now that I really think about it she, when I was feeling scared or nervous or uncomfortable about do I have it she said yes you have this and you can do this and you have the talent to see it through and you're on the right track and so those are the types of things that a parent would hopefully tell their child but in this particular case I needed it so much. That's the perfect thing to hear, perfect words. Let me ask you, did, are you were you shocked or surprised by the fields that your daughter decide, decided to enter to or did you think that she would follow in your footsteps and pursue a political career? I never thought she would follow a, a political career because she has this artistic bent and this creative bent and I have a son and a daughter. The, the son is more political. Nicole is more creative, but what brings us together is our passion for the issues. For me, I work in, in politics to make life better for people. For her, she right now is, is a documentary filmmaker working to make life better for people. So it's, it's just a wonderful connection, but it's very different talents that you bring to the table. That's amazing. So now let me ask you, we're in the midst of a wild political campaign coming up. Do you have any thoughts or opinions or anything that you would like to share to our viewers? I would. <laughs> I would say, assuming it is Hillary Clinton, and I want to be fair, I wear an H over here, so this is for Hillary. I don't want to lead anyone astray. I am not for Donald Trump. But if it is a Hillary Clinton-Donald Trump race, this is an incredibly important moment because you have one candidate who really divides us, Donald Trump, who has insulted almost every group in our nation, and you have another, Hillary Clinton, who says we're at our best when we bring everyone together. So I really am going to work my heart out for Hillary, and I hope that people understand that they have to register and vote because here's the thing, when somebody says to you, a, my vote doesn't matter. That's just a lazy person. They just don't want to bother. It's wrong. And B, my vote doesn't make a difference. That's just false. The difference couldn't be greater between those two. So I hope everyone within the sound of my voice will, will take this very seriously. Well, thank you guys so much, ladies. I won't keep you any longer from enjoying your wonderful night. And congratulations to the both of you, and well said. <laughs> thank you guys for watching our coverage of the Genie Awards. Make sure to give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. And in the comments below, let us know which female empowers you the most.